In this tutorial, I will show you how to work with pictures or images in your movie. So, what I did here is that I took a screenshot from the video and I imported it into the movie with the import feature here. And I imported a photo and like this. I can import a new photo. But if you want to work with pictures, you might want to unlock some of the more advanced features of um, Video Shop. And you do that with the settings icon in the top left of the screen up here. Okay, so here you can see your toolbar slide and you have a lot of slides, uh, a lot of functions in the first slide and a lot of functions in the second slide. But actually you can activate a lot of the function in another slide, 3 here. So, for example, can Burns effect, where if you want to zoom in or pick on a picture that you have in a video for effect, you can, you can activate it by doing like this say done and now down here this is the first slide this is the second one and right up here in the third slide you will now have the Ken Burns effect and the Ken Burns effect has some standard features you can either pan left like so you can pan the, the image or you can zoom in or you can like this, oh. like this, or you can also do a custom zoom. So you can start in the one end, and then in the other end you can zoom somewhere here. So it will look like this, and you can even make this zoom. Let's see, you can tweak with two fingers, you can decide how much the zoom is going to be, so you can zoom in on the soap bottle if you want. And if you are in the full picture at the end, beginning of the zoom, you can just slowly see that it will zoom in on the soap bottle, like that. So that effect you can set for the pictures, but because this is the free version, I have to watch a video ad to um, to access this feature, but it doesn't cost you anything. Just the other thing that you can do is that you can use transitions between videos, clip, video clips, and also between videos and images. So, if I have a transition between two clips here, I can go to my first video slide here and choose transitions down here. Let's let's have a flash black here. And just say I want to have a flash black transition in the middle. You can see now there's a small um, timer here down the the bottom. And you can see how much the time for the transition is. So if you move the slider here you can have a longer transition between the video clips or a shorter transition between the video clips. So it would look something like this when you play the video. So fade to black, I'm up. The fade to black, the transition will look like this instead. Okay, you can, I'll just choose this clip here and say crossfade and then you'll have a fade over from one to the other like this. If you think that the video is a little too slow for you, you can go to the second second slider of functions here and you can make it a little bit faster. You can reduce the speed and you can increase the speed.
All right, now you can see that this last video bit will have been speed up, sped up by 2.5 times, and you can see how this looks. And that looks pretty funny, and especially if you put the sound on as well. So that's how you work with images, Ken Burns effect, and speed, and transitions in your videos. Have fun.